remember folks, when you can't remember something, try hitting yourself over the head with a book to see if it will jog your memory. Like so. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Uh, where am I? Who am I? What's going on? Who are you? What's going on here? Who, who's he? What, what, what's happening here? So you've probably guessed it, my number eight is Morgan, my precious little girl or boy, depending on what gender I play as. Either way, they're your child. I guess I'm sort of cheating here because there are two versions of the character, but they're both pretty much exactly the same character, just of different genders. Morgan is such a great character, albeit in some support conversations a tiny bit on the obnoxious side, but I still think they're a great character regardless. I really like the touch of having them have amnesia like Robin or whatever you called your unit. Yeah, it's a little bit tongue-in-cheek, but I, I, I still found it amusing. And their support builds with their parents and, depending on how you marry, their siblings as well are just great with them trying to get their memory back and going for the most um, out their ways possible. I, I found that really fun to, fun to read, fun to watch. It was, yeah, it, it was just, it was just amusing to me. I, I enjoyed it. And it's kind of sweet as well, seeing like your unit, whoever their other parent is and whatever siblings they may have, trying to, you know, show support to Morgan and trying to get their memories back, but at the same time saying, don't worry too much about it. You're here now. We know who you are. You know, you're still, you're still my son, daughter, uh, brother, sister, whatever, so, you know, it doesn't matter. I like that, I thought it was all really touching as well as being amusing. And, just like with Cynthia, or really any of the child characters, depending on their parentage, Morgan can be a powerhouse. <laughs> oh my word, I mean, in any battle where I've taken on somebody else's army via street pass, or spot pass, or whatever the heck it is that they let you pick up other people's armies, whenever, whenever I've taken on other people's armies, nine times out of ten, their most powerful unit will be Morgan. And even in my own armies, Morgan was one of the most powerful characters there. Morgan, oh my gosh, unleashing Morgan and Cynthia together it was massacre. <laughs> it almost makes me feel sorry for for the enemy army. <laughs> yeah, overall Morgan's just a great character who's a lot of fun to watch and whenever <laughs> whenever they're out there slaughtering the enemy armies I'm like, that's my girl! Or if I'm playing in my female file, that's my boy! <laughs> <laughs> Make sure to let me know in the comment section what you think of Morgan, and do be sure to tell me who some of your favourite Fire Emblem Awakening characters are as well. As always, if you like this video, please don't forget to thumbs up it and share it with your friends. And if you're new here and you want to hear more of me talking about Fire Emblem Awakening characters, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter as well, there will be a link in the description, and I frequently talk about Fire Emblem and other video games I like there. I shall see everybody tomorrow. I forget what I'm doing. Oh god, that actually did hurt me a little bit when I hit myself over the head with that. <laughs> oh, and in case you're wondering what I hit myself in the head with, it was my Bible. <laughs>